Hello, I'm Ethan, and this is part 6 of my 9 part video series on how to do a full PLL. If you want to watch the whole series, you can click the card up there. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to do the EPERM. Before we start though, there is an important finger trick that you need to know that is crucial to making sure you can do this algorithm quickly, and it's the D prime push with your left hand. This move will be used a lot during the EPERM, so make sure you can do it very quickly. If you can do that, then we're ready to learn the algorithm, so let's get started. It's generally agreed that the EPERM is the hardest PLL algorithm to recognise. Firstly, it's a diagonal swap PLL, so there are no headlamps, and also it's the only PLL with no blocks to recognise from. The way to recognise which angle to hold it at to do the algorithm is that once you have all of the edges in the correct places, you want the pairs of swapped corners to be going vertically. Another way to recognise that is by looking at this colour on the side of the edge, so this is orange, and you can see that these two stickers are orange, which means that these two corners need to swap, and therefore these two corners need to swap. So the algorithm is really just a set of R, a U move, R prime, and then a D move four times. So the way I remember it is that the U moves go U prime, U, U, U prime, and the D moves just alternate D, D prime, D, D prime. So once you're holding it in the correct position, the way you do this algorithm is you start with your cube rotation, and then you do R, U prime, R prime, D, R, U, R prime, D prime push, R, U, R prime, D, R, U prime, R prime, D prime push. This is one of the fastest PNL algorithms to execute, but when you combine it with the recognition time, it's actually quite slow. So make sure you can recognise this algorithm as fast as possible. So thank you for watching this video. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, click the button over there to get a notification when I upload the next video in this series. So I will see you next time. Bye.